Okay, so welcome back, I guess, to uh, that Swedish guys. Let's play uh, The Walking Dead. Now I apologize because by this point it's been very slow with the uploads, but I have very limited time when I can upload, and I hope you can see and respect that. But otherwise, let's go. Let's do this. Let's uh, survive the apocalypse. Let's do bad decisions. Let's do all of that crap right now. And uh, I gotta remember that not just to highlight the fucking text, but to click it. Previously on The Walking Dead. Oh, I love these. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. Yeah. You've been good to me and my family. You Damn saved right. Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. Well, you're dead now, He's so. not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! No! <laughs> Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Hmm. Goddamn! Bitches be crazy! So is the loading screen. Oh. Yeah, I know. Telltale Games presents. In association with Skybound Entertainment! The Walking Dead. Episode 3. Oh yeah. Don't go and da da. Hmm, doesn't work in Swedish. Oh! Hell yeah. Supply run, even though we just got supplies. But then again, this might be a few months ahead. Long road ahead. This one was. Looks like this is our lucky day. Oh. Maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. Yeah, well, the less I see, the happier I am. True. But you can never let your guard down. Okay. I like this point and click adventure sort of game style. And I said, I'm going to try to be funny. Lee. Where do you come down on staying or going? You mean, packing up the motel and getting in the RV? Yeah, we've been talking about it, but have you made up your mind yet? Oof. Shit, I have no idea. I know it's a tough call, but come on, man. You know it's the way to go. Yeah, I should go with him. We're friends, and we'll stick together and all that crap. Why didn't I say we should go? God damn it, already! I am... Okay, just like last time. Wrong. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Hmm. Oh, let's see here. Oh, shit. Of course. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. And suddenly my rifle disappears. There's no safe way through that mess. I was getting annoyed that you can't run, but I'm sort of happy that you can't run neither. Because, uh... Oop, sweet. That would break. Sorry. <clears throat> Climb up, perhaps? Huh. Huh. He said thoughtfully. Uh, well. Oh. Hmm. Right. 
down into the pharmacy shit. Oh, shit. Saw that. Hmm. Looks like it still works. Looks like we're gonna use it. Lily's not doing so good, huh? <laughs> yeah. Well, we killed her dad. We did kill her dad. Shit, man. And oof. Let's see if we can touch with something else. Nope. Okay, just because I'm curious, I'm gonna see what's gonna happen. I know it's gonna break or whatever. Yeah. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. <laughs> Better get a move on. Called it. Uh, I can't push it to start wheeling in. Perhaps it's inside. Yeah. Exactly. Girl still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon? Oh, man. I hope not. She'll get there. It's about survival, man. You leave that shit unattended, you fucking suffer. It's not stealing if it's not guarded. God damn it. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Oh shit. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. Damn kids. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. <laughs> Shit! Ow. The fuck, man? Oh, don't... No, 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 no. <sighs> oh, nice one. Next time I'm bringing Ben. Help me get out. Ah! Oh, shit. No! No! What the fuck? No way! Go! No! Oh, fuck. Help you. me! Ah! Somebody help me! Holy shit. Oh, God! Oh, God! What the... What the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Wait! No! No! It's a girl. She's gonna get us killed. No shit. Actually... Fuck. Gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. No, we're here. What do you mean? I mean... We leave her alive, and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Oh, yeah, think shit, about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. That's your fucking hell, man. No! No! No way! No! No way! No! Oh, God! Shit! Oh, God. Yeah. We'll have to deal with it. No, why did I do that? <laughs> One girl suffering. What the fuck? God damn it. What the fuck? <laughs> Shit, stupid. Now what you doing? Let's move. Okay, I'm fucking inhumane, but I'm not that inhumane, okay? I may fucking help. I just couldn't. <laughs> the goddamn game forcing me to watch it too. Fuck! Incoming! Come on, Lee! Stupid, stupid, stupid. It's sturdy as hell, but we ain't got much time. Get everything you can out of these racks. Shit, I didn't think it was. Don't forget time. underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Fucking grab, 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 grab. I don't care what I'm grabbing. Just I don't even fucking read it. 
I'm just grabbing shit. Come on. Grab it! Shit! Why? I could have done this calmly. Calmly and fucking peacefully, but no. Okay, fuck that. We need fucking food. What is it? Supplies. Supplies. Shit! The time! The time! Medicine box. Fucking... No! I have no time! What the fuck? Fuck! Incoming! Come on, Lee! Shit! Up and over. We're still clear. Let's hustle! Jimmy! Oh, fucking hell. Ah! Come on! Uh, oh, what the fuck you need? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Shoot, they're already on us. What the fuck am I supposed to do with this? Fucking oh, shit. Now, let's fucking get out. Yes, indeed. Oh, boy, of course. You're fucking tired. I just told him to stop being fucking sentimental and I couldn't let a girl suffer. So we have. No! I would have time! Why the fuck did I do that? I would have time to fucking take out all the. Oh my god. I gotta be stopped being so fucking selective when I choose to be a fucking human and choose to be fucking logical. Ugh. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. <laughs> hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Oh, God. I'm stupid. I think, I, I think while being out walking, I just forgot the whole seriousness of it all. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Ha. Huh. The fuck? So, what did you get? A lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This will keep us going. Uh, if we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you two, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. Hmm. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. And that's all beside the fact that Macon is busting at the seams with walkers. We don't have walker problems. We have to go eventually, Lily. We don't have to do anything. You didn't want to go because of your dad's health. But he's gone now. Easy, kid. Ouch. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. And don't start with me, either. Ken, we're all losing it with the attacks and lack of food. Everything can't come down to the same disagreement. Lily, Kenny's got some legit points here. I'm so tired of it being you two versus Damn me. Damn it. I'm not on anyone's side, Lily. These decisions affect everyone. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you know What about it. medicine? What about medicine? We got plenty of food from that station wagon. No, wait, we I can't didn't just mean that. keep our fingers crossed for more station wagons. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. We wouldn't even be fighting about our medicine and supply stocks if Lee hadn't fucked up downtown. What the fuck? What do you mean? 
Some Dude. girl came screaming out of an alley. She Dude, had the dead hanging all over her. She was making enough noise that we would have had plenty of time to get what we needed. What Instead, smart guy shot her. He what? He put her out of her misery. Stupid. Instead of what? Letting her suffer? You guys couldn't try to save her? You shot her instead. What's done is done. Uh, it was a mistake. You bet your ass it was. Y'all <laughs> should be giving Lee hell for not doing what needed to be done. It's not what so easy for him. Fuck. Look, I always had your its fucking back. Savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers, and the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth, and it's coming this way. It's not going to be easier out on the road. How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's oh, right, shit. stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out! You fucking... Happy, Kenny? My family's alive and that RV is running. You goddamn right I am. Everyone is under great stress. Fuck you! She's right about one thing. None of this is getting any easier. Fuck you, man. You fucking sold me out. After all I did for you, you can keep your fucking mouth shut. Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Well, Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Hey, I'm getting laid. The first thing I'm gonna do is fucking talk to Kenny. That shit was not okay. Oof. Kenny and I need to fucking talk after all I did to him. After all I did for him. Oof, you and I are gonna have a serious. Hey, you bit. two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? You need to try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it, given all that's happened. So what then? Time will come, we'll have to do what's best for our families. And that's what we'll do. He's talking about killing again. You guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. Hmm. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. I'll talk to you later. Uh, I don't know. Should I have the subtitles on or should I have the subtitles off? I can't. They fucking bother me. I'm gonna see how this goes. I'm gonna try not talk in their mouths. Uh, uh. Hi, guys. Oh. Hi, Lee. Yeah, it definitely became more alive. <laughs> I want to kick Ken Kenny's ass. I'm not going to lie. I want to I wanna fucking kick his ass. That was not cool. Let's okay nonsense. Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? Have you seen anything weird on the watch? Is there anybody out there up to anything? Nope. Really quiet. Really? Yeah, totally. Which is good. Did you ever come down here to making much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. Hmm. I grew up in Macon. Oh. I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. <laughs> it's super nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. Is... Uh... What do you think about Lily? She scares the crap out of me. That's a reasonable thing to feel. 
I'm just worried she's going to snap. Yeah. Talk to you later, Ben. Bye. You and me both, man. You Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. Hmm. Oh, boy. Hmm. So we have people constantly trying to fucking... Okay, guys, when that shit happens, just fucking let people die. If they draw attention away from the zombies, just let it go. Just fucking shut off your emotions or shit like that. Because that shit was not cool. Fucking, I, I messed up. Badly. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Hmm. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. Hmm. See? It's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah, that'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Sure. Okay. Okay. Uh, fucking, should I have subtitles? Ah, uh, I'm gonna try with subtitles. <laughs> this is this is my fucking great A problem. Not the zombies, not anything, having subtitles on or off. Yeah, but fucking creepers. But I'm gonna have them on just because then I can speak freely and you guys can still pay attention to the freaking zombies or whatever text or Talk to Lily yet? No, not yet. I will. What I wanted to say was I've been thinking a lot Yay. about you. Oh. Actually I'm gonna I'm gonna have some love. I think about you too. Our group is small. You're small. <laughs> You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. What the hell? Then why? People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. Well, I did trust Kenny. Uh, I don't know what to fucking say to that. It was a lifetime ago. Which is only going to make the feeling that you hid it and that there was even more to hide that much worse. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. That, that is true. So you'll do it then? Shit. Ah, oh, fuck, she is so right! Better hear it from, better hear it from the horse's mouth or what the fuck you say. Ah, oh, Yavla, bitch! I feel good. Okay, okay, wait. I'm gonna think here. If I was a convicted killer, she knows, and it's always gonna hang in there. Fuck up. I'll let people know. You're totally right. Shit. Good. I think it's for the best. Can we have sex now? Oh my god! Yay! Don't call me small. <laughs> Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? This escalated real fast. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Mm. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. Hmm. Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. <laughs> I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her, that's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. Ugh, oh, Lily is gonna... Fucking flip. In case she hears that I'm a convicted murderer and kill her father. Boy. Nope. 
poor woman, when you think about it. I'm sorry. What? You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Hmm. I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. And you came in here to confess? What? I'm not stealing shit. I came in here to help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. What the fuck? Lily. Counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? <laughs> I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? Hmm. I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Hmm. Okay, I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. If you don't find anything, I'm just going to assume it's you. What the fuck? Whore. A mystery. What the hell? Oh, him. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. <laughs> can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. <laughs> you can't help. And if you tell anybody, it will be trouble. Secrecy. Did you hear what I just said? I won't tell a soul. The part about not helping? You can't help. I will live in the shadows. <laughs> Fucking kid has snapped. <laughs> oh my god. Hi. It's Lily's room. Yeah, no shit, it's his room. Oh boy, okay. Yeah, we can't go there. Um, when I think about it, the most logical people to actually steal shit would be Kenny. If they would just be splitting. Hmm. A flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. Okay then. Well, I can't suspect her. Okay, this will be Kenny. Okay. Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. I swear to God, it's Kenny. It's fucking Kenny. Stalking. Oh, it could be her. The, his wife stocking up on supplies. Where the fuck is the ice machine? Oh. There's some broken glass on the ground there. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Yep. Hmm. It fits. And X marks the spot. What the fuck? There's something drawn there. Hmm. Chalk. Pink. Hmm. Dark. <laughs> A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I thought I told you you couldn't help. I'm curious. You know.